knowing exactly when to harvest your cucumbers can be a little bit of a trick. And that's because a, there's lots of different varieties of cucumbers, so they all have their own unique windows of optimal deliciousness. And there are just, number two, lots of, there's a window of optimal deliciousness. So you can usually harvest cucumbers at varying stages uh, where there's a few days um, that you have to harvest. So getting to know individual varieties and when they want to be harvested is the fun work that you have before you. Here is um, the classic Market Moore 76 cucumber and some things to keep in mind. So of course, they flower and then once they flower and are pollinated, they start to grow this marvelous ovary that we think of as a cucumber. Um, and I love when they're super small, you can still see that yellow flower hanging off at the end. As they grow a little bit larger, um, that <laughs> blossom falls off and you can see this was where it was attached to the stem so it's getting all of these nutrients all of this water from the stem and it hasn't quite they haven't quite reached the base yet so it's this funny shape um, and it's starting to fill out a little bit here as the cucumber is getting larger this for market more is a delicious cucumber um, and here is where it's at its classic american slicer stage um, nice and even um, and and as it gets a little bit bigger, this is still green. I would totally eat this, but I totally eat any cucumber I can because they're kind of my favorite vegetable. This I would probably skin. I would never skin the rest of these cucumbers because they're just so tender and the skin is so flavorful and delicious. But by the time your cucumber is this big, generally, <laughs> this skin is starting to get tough. It's starting to get bitter starting to get a little acrid as well and so but the actual inside the white fleshy fruit of it would still be delicious and as the seeds start to swell they're actually pretty sweet so this is probably an edible cucumber but probably not for the average American give it a try but err on the side of this for sure and any cucumber as it matures its seed is going to turn yellow and by the time it's starting to turn yellow this is full of gross compounds that are just bitter and astringent and acrid all at once um, you would and it would just be so gross and the seeds are starting to turn really hard as well so you'd never eat this um, so you can let it go for seed if you like and know that any cucumber will cross with any other cucumber within a mile so it could be a fun breeding project if you're growing more than one different type of cucumber um, but if I when I was growing up and we weren't saving seed of cucumbers if we found yellow cucumbers we harvested them and threw them into the compost because once a cucumber makes its seed and is maturing its seed it thinks oh I'm done I'm all done. I don't have to create cucumbers anymore. But if you keep harvesting your fruiting crops, especially your cucurbits like zucchini and cucumbers, the more you keep harvesting them, the more they're going to stimulate to keep growing, keep flowering, keep fruiting. And so don't let any of them get to this stage. If you do, pick them anyway, toss them in your compost. Yes, have friends. Friends have so much fun. There are so many different varieties of cucumbers that have so many different flavors. We have lots of disease resistant ones as well. And the key, just keep harvesting them and harvest them at different sizes, different shapes, different colors. See what you like best and appreciate all of the diversity that our ancestors have selected for countless generations so that we can be eating cucumbers today.